Now here I am, man, coming out of the store and I get a text. My girl telling me to come home ASAP. Something she wants to show me, something she wants to tell me. Now I have no idea what she wants, what she wants to tell me. So at this point, I'm nervous as hell. But as I get home, bro, things just seem to be clicking in my head about what happened the other night. I don't have to go into details. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Things start going through my head. I didn't know what to think. She told me that she was pregnant. Now what could instantly go through my mind is like, I'm going to be a father. I'm going to be a father. Now, she didn't know the sex of the baby yet, but she took five pregnancy tests. And all, all of them came back positive. It's like, I'm going to be there for my daughter or son, whatever it might be. But now, I really have something to live for. Start my own family. Yo, this is... So I said, you know what? I'm going to reassure her that I'm going to be here. For her, you know, daughter or son, it don't matter. You know what? The time is now. I'm one of the greats in Texas long on history. You know what? Yo, I'm just proud, man. Just really proud. Yo, what's good, Create Nation, man? We are in the season finale. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed that intro, man. We are taking on number one LSU. I believe Derek Stingley is a senior, man. They got a number three, you know, as points per game. 12th in total defense. Our defense is stepping up, man. Usually, it's about 8 to 100, but we had 75 passing defense. But these are the career, or well, season stats, man. Or a little over 3,200 yards, 38 touchdowns, two interceptions. You know what I mean? And like I want a little side note, man. He, your boy X, is a father, man. And for in real life, man, it's, it's definitely a life change, man. To all the parents out there, the dads, y'all know them, yo. I don't hang out with no fault, man. It's just a special feeling. But back to this, man. We yeah, we won the Heisman again, man. Definitely won the Heisman again. As you can see, the passing numbers really wasn't quite there. You know, his, his second season, as you can see, the rushing yards has definitely dipped <laughs> by year by year by year. Like I said, he want to show the scouts, man, that he definitely can, you know, do more than just run, man. And the numbers show that it's definitely declined over the past three years. These are the season stats on our receivers. More Smith. A lot of these guys are upper class, man, seniors, so... Definitely gonna miss them. We gonna miss X, man. This is the final episode of this series, and yo, I can't thank TNJ enough, man, because <laughs> I didn't know what direction I wanted to go in as far as I know I wanted to do revamp, but you know he he suggested it, and y'all took heed to it. But yeah, like I said, we won the Heisman yet again. Yeah, Milton from Georgia finishing at number two. We got Barlow from TCU. He finished third. Our very own Robinson, man. Robinson, who finished fourth, and he got Nats from San, Diego, San Jose State, who finished in last, man. But, yeah, it's crazy, man. The total career stats, over 10,000 yard passing. That's crazy. 108 touchdowns, 10 interceptions, about 275 a game, 69% completion percentage, man. That is absolutely absurd. That is crazy. A total rushing yards, boy, Robinson over 4,500. Your boy, Xavier, nearly 4,200 yards, man. 49 touchdowns. Robinson got 69 touchdowns. Career long for Xavier, 98 yards. Y'all remember that video. Y'all remember it, man. But Pollard, 375 with three touchdowns. Unfortunately, we won't get to see what he can do. Being that this is the last episode, but that's okay, though. That is definitely okay. You know, this is... The stats with the receivers, man, career numbers more. Mill over 2,900. Smith over 3,000. 34 touchdowns for, as well as more. J Dub, eight touchdowns, over 1,300 yards. Robinson, two touchdowns. I feel like we should have got him more involved in the pass game. You know what I mean? The F6 touchdown, 359. Got Woodard, 432 and 6. Touchdowns. Like I said, a lot of these guys are upperclassmen. But here we are, baby. National championship game. 
take it off Derek Stingley in a number one LSU Tigers and Robinson carries up the middle for 10. I got a feeling that he needs to have, even though the quarterback is the go-to person on the team, but for this team, man, Robinson needs to set the tone. He he needs to be that, that gas, man. He needs to be that engine that gets the whole team going. But second and five right here, they are sending the blitz right here. They definitely do not want this kid to get outside the pocket. They want to make him panic. You know, and, that, and when he panics, that causes mistakes. So that's what they trying to do. We're going to counter that. Robinson, bro. Pollard, <laughs> he picks up eight, man. But yeah, this is crazy, man. This is definitely crazy, man. Second and two. Yo. Our defense really hasn't been that good, man. Y'all know that, man. But third and 11 right here. Yo, check this shit. I'll buy this safety, man. Bro, our defense is like, this how they should have played all along, man. That's how they should have played all along, but first and 10 right here, and we throw an absolute dot right over their head to Smith, who steps up first and goal, baby. First and goal, hand off to Robinson, up the cut, yo. This is how I was supposed to take it. With our defense playing like this, yo, <laughs> we are unbeatable, man. Of course, when we're not causing, you know, doing turnovers, but 38 right here, they get it down to Jenkins, and he goes out of bounds. All right, first and 10. Read option to Robinson and good play by right there. By big snackums. All right, second and ten. Have that counter to Robinson. Y'all see, we trying to throw a block out there, man. And Robinson picks up 931. That's been our yo. I said that before in the past, bro. Every time we run the ball up up the middle, bro, we getting first down after first down after first down, man. As Robinson picked up 14. All right, first and ten. I wanted to hit that dig route, but Pollard, oh, yes, sir. Boy, yes, sir, man. Robinson picks up 16. Like I said, I, I, I hate that I can't see what this kid can do, man. Another good play by the number 39 right there. But, yo, all right, second and 10. Oh, I should have hit Smith. Yo, I should have hit Smith. Bro, looking back on it, I should have hit Smith, man. But when you playing, you don't see that. You don't notice those things, man. The third and four right here. Ooh, I wanted that corner route. But we gonna settle to JW. He picks up a first down. Who sets up first and goal? All right, first and goal. Bro, they ready for that run, man. <laughs> Good audible by your boy Xavier. Who is Robinson? Yes, sir. Let's go, man. And our defense got us back the ball in fairly good position. And now that I realize it, bro. I should have called timeout. I didn't realize it when I was playing. <laughs> like, no cap. I did not realize that the time was that low, man. But second half action, man, we up 21 to skunk. Read option to Robinson, and he picks up five. All right, second and five. Now, on the side note, man, on the side note, if y'all made it this far in the video, I already got, you know, the season one debut of the It's a Miami thing, the next RTG. Ready to go. I just need to pick out a team. I'm going to leave that up to y'all. And right here, I'm so glad that we got rid of that, man. Definitely don't want to cause no boneheaded decision to get them any kind of momentum. And look at this. D yes, sir. Your boy Moore burnt your boy Derrick Stingley and tack on 15 yards. Now, he didn't outrun it, you know, your boy Stingley, but <laughs> he got the best of them right there. Oh, I should have hit score. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir, baby. Let's go. Why well, I wanted to take off on down. All right, first and 10. One safety high. See if we can take a shot deep. No, we don't. And we hit Smith on a little slant route. And he picks up seven. All right, second and three. Oh, yes, sir. Robinson of the gut, man. And him knowing him, knowing NCAA revamp, he might end up going to the pros. So you just never know. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> we seen that for three years, man. Three years. Yo, I cannot believe this is the final episode of this series, man. It is crazy. 
absolutely crazy, man. But second and seven right here, play action. Oh, good dot, boy. Your boy money with one foot down, baby. Let's go first and go fourth quarter action, man. Four minutes into this final episode. And right here, I don't know what I was thinking. As we go down for a sack, third and goal right here. Bro, everything is sold up. And you know when that happens, your boy got the wheels, baby. Let's go. Now, we're going to watch our defense see what they can do. Brennan. Oh, yes, sir. But Yo, our defense has come to play. Why they can't play like this all the time, man? All right, second and 11. And every opportunity you, you cannot waste right here. Look at you. How was that not a fumble, bro? All right, third and 11. We are constantly bringing the blitz. And he get it out to Jenkins, make the play. <laughs> he fell forward. Like, he fell forward on that dude, man. But first and 10. This game is pretty much in the bag. It's pretty much in the bag. He, Jenkins picks up eight, man. It's a break with second and two. Bro, why are y'all running, man? Y'all are down by 28. And y'all running? I'm like, come on, man. All right, third and three. Bruh, are y'all serious right now? <laughs> like, yo, that's crazy. They end up putting the ball, and that is it, folks. Back to back to back national champions. You know, a lot of people out there say, oh, you winning too much, bro. It's all part of the content, man. Don't don't take it to bite my head. It's all part of the content, man. But, yo, this dude has definitely established himself. It's one of the greats in Texas long on history, man. He's up there with Vince Young, man. He's definitely up there. Colt McCoy, too, man. Sam Elliger, he's up there, man. Player of the game. And yo, it is it's been a long 30 episodes, but I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. And once again, man, big shout out to TNJ. Man, appreciate you. And I'm gonna keep doing the good roll, man. Thanks to y'all. Love y'all to death. And yo, <laughs> I can't thank y'all enough, man. Till next time, I'm gone.